Ah, it's me. Yeah, okay, video. Um, okay, I'm going to attach a little video I made, uh, walk and talk video on the end of this thing, and I said something in that video about Machine Ghost Guy, and saying something like Xenophobe or something on one of my other videos, and yeah, it was the Alphabet video, I forgot. Anyway, so I blocked him, but I unblocked him, so I unblocked you. But you are commenting obscurely and irrelevantly, and your videos are contradictory and sometimes incomprehensible, still. But anyway, yeah, sorry. Um, anyway, so two other fucknuts. I'm not near, much more fucknutty than Machine Ghost Guy, who's a nice guy, generally speaking. So, Wise Monkey has made another video, four minutes, which seems to be his standard, but absolutely says nothing. All he does is go tisk tisk. I mean, it's another one of these tisk tisk videos. Oh, you want to kill little two year olds? No, that's not the point. I mean, it's like he missed the whole point of the video. He doesn't, I guess, know that bacon is made from pigs that are kept in little cages and tortured. So I guess he doesn't understand that a two-year-old dying in its sleep can't possibly <laughs> be more of a tragedy to sentience on planet Earth than a pig in a cage suffering for two or three years. But he's too stupid to get it. Um, but yeah, just garbage. No argument whatsoever. Just a complete waste of four minutes. The stupid tree guy, who, you know, I was done with two years ago or whatever. Complete lunatic. Um, I think he's another one of these wacky Scotman. I think Scotland needs to take its medication. Um, but anyway, so he makes this, calls, calls people girl boys. His girl boy fans. Girl boy fans? Yeah, that's clever. Yeah, you're a real intellectual with your little 67. Is that your IQ? 67. Yeah, that's your IQ. You're a little bit smarter than Coco the Gorilla, maybe. Maybe, no, I don't know. Coco was about 65, I think. Um, but anyway. Um, all right, so yeah, he makes one argument in there that, the, oh, the two-year-old's going to grow up to be Einstein. It's, a, it's the same old argument by that logic we should all preserve every one of our sperm, never masturbate, and try to find a uterus somewhere so we can, you know, our an egg, human eggs, and just, you know, keep making more and more babies because we want another Einstein. Uh, the, guess what? Um, you know, the theory of evolution was inevitably going to be discovered. Charles Darwin wasn't exactly Einstein. Um, and Einstein's theories would have been eventually discovered. So let's not overvalue contributions. I mean, the sock vaccine was probably 50 years, 75, 100 years ahead of its time. Who knows? Um, really good stuff. Um, and that's great. But it's not part of this thought experiment anyway. I mean, if you want me to change the thought experiment. Do you understand the words thought experiment? No, you probably don't. Um, but anyway, if you want me to change the variable, oh, yes, the, the two-year-old would you going to grow up to be just an average human being, have no real impact on human civilization beyond the fact that it, she was going to die um, after um, drinking heavily, giving a smelly Scotsman a blow job, and then crashing her car into a tree. But that was the only notable thing that was going to happen in her life. Uh, just real average otherwise retard. I mean, you really are just too, you're too stupid for me to waste any time on. Um, and not too many people do waste any time on you, so most people understand that. So anyway, the good news is, though, that uh, my subscription box is still broken, so I have to go to my home page. Darwin's hamster's back. He made a couple of antinatalism videos. I did thummy up. Um, but yeah, really good to have his input. Sort of demanding that people do stick to some sort of logical explanation. And he's sort of making the point um, that I sort of made in the last video that I have been kind of emphasizing a little bit lately. Um, just this idea that, look, I think antinatalism wins on full logic. Even, even on the ultimate productivity equation, just because, yeah, it's the way to minimize the losses. It's fail-safe. And it's very debatable whether this human ambition, desire mechanism is worth anything. If without the addiction, there really isn't. If I take away your hunger, there's nothing there. Okay, you're not going to eat. That's just the truth. And so this idea of our satisfaction or our, our, our pleasure is just derived because we create an artificial deficit that needs satisfying. Um, and you're just not aware of the complexity of the deficit sometimes. 
uh, you get relieved of fear or relieved of tension or relieved of worry. These are all mechanisms created in you, create a negative state, so when they're relieved you feel a positive state. And that's what a drug basically does. It basically takes away the pain you didn't even know you were in. Uh, but regardless, that's a whole other issue. So even on that it wins. But I think even more superficially, it wins on this just basic fairness argument. If you're going to argue for all these other ethical equations in our society where you have the right to be free from somebody else's interference or free from this or free from that and all this freedom crap that all you jackasses are always preaching, um, by that standard, you're imposing, okay? You're violating someone's freedom to say, I don't want to be part of your sick, sadistic little human life game. Um, so until you can weed me out of the population, until you can make sure, until you can give me a guaranteed um, abortion before I'm born, uh, you have no right to allow something to become intelligent enough to realize you're all a bunch of emperors wearing no fucking clothes, out of your fucking mind, chasing cheese doodles, and you all look like assholes doing it. Um, and so until you stop people from being smart enough to see you for the stupid fat moronic fucktards that you are, um, animal abusing, um, you know, sloppy, greedy, selfish, um, deficit spending morons that you are, uh, so until you make that impossible for somebody to realize they're living in a shitty world run by shitty people, um, yeah, count me out, keep me out, um, but you have no right to impose it, you have no right to presume you're going to be able to have a baby dumb enough to fall for it like you did, idiots. Um, but anyway, I mean, I want to put words in Darwin's hand. Uh, he obviously would not have been as impolite as I was in stating that. Um, but anyway, it's just good to see Joe again. I missed him. You know, he was all mad at me for a while, but it's apparently okay now, which is good. I like Joe. Um, so anything else I got to add here? Throwing a little lecture. Yeah, this next video, it's called Another Great Video. It really is funny, you know, towards the end. So this, the, the last third is pretty funny. Um, but anyway, uh, what else? Any other announcements? Uh, yeah, no, I mean, I can't seem to get any video of anything. Everything's dead in the world. <gasps> I might mean, just, you know, whatever. Um, so till next time and such. Yeah, I really don't have anything to respond to, right? These are all just junk videos. I don't think anybody made a rational video still. I'm still waiting on, uh, what's his name? Yeah, Dana Garrett. This crazy jackass. I'm still waiting for it, Dana. Come on. If you're so right and we're so wrong, why don't you make one of your little, write up one of your little speeches and speechify it. Come on. Do it. Do it. I dare you. I dare you. I dare you. I dare you. <laughs> Let's see if he's got any new videos. No, it's still nothing new. Two weeks now, Dana. You promised you'd be making a video every week. Come on, Dana. Come on. Man up. Um, let me just check the amendum thing here. Let's see if there's any new videos. Do, 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 do. Nope, just mine. I don't know why this monkey's video is here twice for whatever dumb reason. But just absolute crap video. Crap, 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 crap. And uh, I suppose that's it. Uh, yeah, I think so. Uploading. Uh, subscription's broken. Yeah, you see, look at my subscription box. It's just completely broken. Yeah, I mean, I go to subscriptions here. Where is it? Here they are. Look, it's last week's videos. Top of the list, last week's videos. I'll try one more time just for the fun of it. Do, 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 do. Well, yep, last week's videos. Just bullshit. Completely, preposterously stupid. Yeah, that's what that is. A week old. So, anyway, YouTube sucks and such. There's not much else to say there. Alright, sorry, I'm wasting a little bit of time. Um, what's something else I wanted to mention? Yeah, conference report did do a few videos on this other channel. He's not saying anything directly yet, but he did do like three videos or two anyway. Yeah, three of them on antinatalism today. Um, and in this last one, he does at the end say, "Well, it probably isn't worth it. Um, it's all a pile of shit." 
um, you know, that we really can't progress our way out of it. We really are just stomachs and, you know, sex organs and that's about all we are. I mean, and, you know, we got this little scheming thing on top of those two things that try to figure out how to get stuff in the stomach and how to get stuff in the sex organs, sort of, or whatever the inverse for that is. Um, and, yeah, the rest of it is all just the soap opera revolving around doing that stuff. And that's really all there is. It's the only game in town. It's, it's the only game that's going to be in the future. And progress isn't going to progress us out of the mechanism, which is I want. And if I actually give you what you want, I mean, if I get my fantasy life, you know, uh, two weeks later, I'm going to be like, this marble isn't shiny enough. And, uh, you know, one of her breasts is bigger than the other one. And I don't like it. Um, yeah, I'm going to start nitpicking my perfect life. And I'm going to start finding it's not going to be enough. I'm going to say, this isn't enough still. Somehow it's just not quite enough still. I want more. It's always, we're always going to end up doing that kind of shit. We're just neurotic that way. You know, if, if you bowl a 300, the next day you're going to try to bowl a 301. You're going to try. Even though it's not possible, you're just going to say, I could have done it even more perfectly. I, I mean, we're just compulsive lunatics. I mean, you're going to try to do two in a row or something. I mean, it just, we're, we're just, we're, that's just the way we are. So it ain't going to work. Give it up already, people. But I was arguing, look, I'm, you know, <clears throat> the whole point of this anti-natalism thing really is just to, you know, knock this all down to some manageable level anyway. But, yeah, I mean, the whole idea of just having some sort of stipend of human race would be really nice. But, you know, we can't do that. We, if we tried to, say, have like a million people on planet Earth, then we'd argue about how many were black and how many were white and how many were Asian and how many were all these other things. Um, we just fucking make a mess out of it. Um, and if we did it for the purpose of advancing science and just trying to figure out for sure, you know, whether there's any potential here or not, um, it would just get out of control. You know something would go wrong. The whole thing would end up reverting back to what it was and the animal would be set free again. I mean, it's it's just like keeping smallpox in a, in a little cage somewhere. You just know if you keep it in a little cage somewhere, it's going to get out. You just, there's no point in playing with it. Uh, you know, kill it. Uh, annihilate it. And make sure it can never escape. Uh, so anyway, enough of a video. I think so. I'm wearing my shirt. I painted, painted this like, I don't know, 15 years ago. <laughs> yeah. I really, I used to be a starving artist and now I'm just a starving YouTube time waster. But it really doesn't make much difference, does it? I don't think it does. Probably not. Hmm. Well, maybe. I mean, it makes some difference, right? Because, yeah, I mean... Yeah, I've, you know, I've done something. I mean, so, yeah. Alright, yeah. So this is probably better waste of time. Probably. Maybe. Maybe. Anyway, so thing unattached on the end, blah, blah, blah. I'll have some better video of stuff eventually. I uh, just got to find some wildlife that isn't suffocating or dying. So anyway, till next time and such. I got to find time, too. I got way too much stuff to do. Way behind. Yeah, I figure I'll tack this on to some video. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing it with the underwater camera. Yeah, I just, uh, I kind of just noticed that I feel kind of lonely without my camera now. So when I'm walking by myself and I'm not talking and uh, you know sometimes I'll walk home listening to the video I made on the way and uh, yeah so now it feels kind of uh, you know really broken when I don't have the camera with me. So it is kind of funny. You know when I go for a run I don't uh, travel light as they say and uh, so yeah, I can just take the one camera with me. Um, so, anyway, very, very, um, just, just a, a little bit of a uh, I notice thing. Uh, neuroticness creeping in. Uh, yeah, battery's almost dead on this thing, so I don't know how long this will work. Uh, but anyway, the other thing I wanted to mention was my subscription box <laughs> is broken. I've been like that for a couple of weeks. I figured YouTube would fix things, but they haven't. Seems to work on the Inmenum channel, but doesn't work on the Gloom, Doom, and Boom. I just keep getting 
Now this thing for videos that are like 10 days old. Oh, it's kind of strange. And then, I didn't notice another weird thing. I don't know whether Amazing Atheist uh, free speech vids.com got hacked or whether he's just, you know, fucking around. Ow! Fucking harsh fly got me right on the hand. Damn it! <laughs> that's what I get for making a video that's unscheduled. Um, yeah, it's directed to my website, which is kind of funny. So if he did it on purpose, it's kind of a neat thing to do. Uh, somebody hacked it. Well, that sucks. I mean, you know, that's just being a jackass. Quit hacking shit, hackers. Even evil people don't deserve to get hacked. It's hacking is bullshit. You know, once you license that kind of crap, it just fucks everything up. So stop it. Don't direct anything to my website, especially. I don't want to sanction or I don't want to be part of your little prankstery. Um, so anyway, just funny. Just the thing. Somebody somebody posted a link to somewhere. You know, I would not know myself, but uh, it's kind of funny. Curious, strange, bizarre, weird. I didn't notice whether there's any extra traffic to my site because of it. <laughs> I haven't looked at the. I just never look at traffic numbers. I just don't give a shit. I should pay attention because I really should do something besides blocking people. Yeah, I had to block that stupid machine ghost guy. He pissed me off too many times. He's been too obscure, too weird, too inconsistent. He posted some kind of xenophobe, xenophobe, whatever kind of comment, and I just was fuck this shit. You know, fuck it. Make if you can't make a coherent, direct easily comprehended comment. Don't fucking comment! Jeez. Anyway. I mean, shit. I mean, you're frustrating Fred, too, you stupid commenters. You're either profoundly stupid or bizarrely obscure. You have to try to do something that's not one of those two things for a change. Yeah, no one's commenting anyway. Hardly anybody. I think the Perry Urban video has one comment on it. <laughs> one. I mean, really. I, maybe I should just stop making videos. Hey, what are those big dogs doing in my woods? They're big. They're a big dog. I don't like that. It's too big. Oh, I know that dog. It's okay. Phew. How's it going? The dog has gotten big! <laughs> yeah, it's really huge! <laughs> Oh yeah, I'm done. Okay, so until next time, you want to force the line side by me in the head now. Fuck, goddamn cunt bastard. Never mind that part. So I'll tack this onto someone, something, somewhere, somehow, somewhat. It's gonna be really dark because it's a, it's a pool camera. <laughs> you know, ain't for regular videos. Damn, a lot of people out. I wish it was hotter. Scare them all away. Anyway, till next time.